Hello everyone, welcome back to Okami. So, in the last episode, we um, tried to deal with the Cutter family, and we also discovered the new village. I want to go back to that village, because I think there's a little bit more to explore. So, what's the map? Well, there it is. So, it's been a little while since I've played, so I've been trying to get uh, FF8 done for you all. Whoa, 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 that's a bit of a drop. <laughs> I do hope you've all been well and that you've been keeping uh, keeping safe and what have you. And uh, I hope you're still enjoying Okami, by the way. It's uh, I freaking love this game. A lot of you have commented about like how just how beautiful it is, and I I completely agree, hundred percent. Right, I think the village was up here. Because if you remember, we lose our brush techniques in this village, and I wondered why. And um, we didn't really explore a whole lot. When I was editing the last video, I realised we didn't really explore much. So I want to have a proper look around. Because that might also might explain why we can't do anything with the Cutter family just yet. Well, the woman. She may have a family, who knows. <laughs> right, okay. Yeah, there's, a, there's an origin mirror there. Like I said, we didn't really look around, did we? Someone with a rain cloud over there. It's gonna have a. It's gonna have a word. Ah, uh, listen. Hello, little doggy. This flower bed used to be really pretty, you know. It was full of flowers, all thriving. In the winter, the water dried up. Oh, okay, so we're gonna have to restore this, but we can't here because there's no. Um, we haven't got any ink. Okay. Let's go up here and see what's happening. See, there's things there that can take us higher, but we can't use them just yet. It's our ink's draining. Yeah. Okay, somebody upset over there. Let's go have a word. Oh, okay. Princess Fuse. Oh, this is most unfortunate. I have been possessed in a momentary lapse of vigilance, and I was trying so hard to defend the village. Now it should be reduced to a horrid, cursed zone. Alas, my strength, it wanes. All is lost. Oh, okay. Damn, okay, these guys got parachutes. Nice. I'm guessing we're going to have to fight this guy without the benefit of the brush, so, yeah. Well, we still can fight, it's just a lot less uh, effective. Okay, it knocks him out of the air. Yeah, I mean, you're kicking the crap out of him. Okay, that's him done. It's the fact that he, like, proper bows his head. Oh, he just put his forehead up, his, up that one's ass. Lovely. Yeah, time's going to be awful on that one just because of the... Uh... But is that going to be enough? Ah, okay, we lift the curse. That's cool. Hmm. Have I been freed from the evil curse? You have saved me, but I do not know how. What the heck happened, sweetness? Oh, are you familiar with my family, the Satomi house? No, I can see now that you are not. Still, you may be of great service to me yet. Will you not listen to what I have to say? You just keep talking, pretty lady. Isun's listening. <laughs> Oh, thank you. I am Princess Fuse, Priestess of the Gale Shrine. Princess Fuse. The Gale Shrine stands atop Mount Kamiji. Kazigami, the God of Wind, is enshrined there. The wind blowing down from there keeps the monsters away. Known as the Divine Wind, 
it is venerated as our protector. However, it suddenly stopped blowing one day, and that has allowed the monsters to sneak into the village. Even I, the last remaining priestess here, was nearly slain. That horrible monster is behind all of this. Okay. Will you hear the rest of my story? There is only one explanation for why the Divine Wind stopped. It's a horrible monster, Crimson Helm. The beast now dwells within the Gael Shrine. The monsters in this area have been all under Crimson Helm's control ever since he appeared in Taka Pass a hundred years ago. My people, the Satomi House, keepers of the Gael Shrine, have been battling the beast and his minions ever since. But last year, the fiends attacked and killed the head priest while he was weakened by sickness, and the Gael Shrine fell into their hands. I remember hearing that story. It was big news in these parts. If only I could vanquish Crimson Helm and free the Gale Shrine, but I'm no match for the evil barrier that now bars entry. There's only one hope. Only the warriors who serve the Satomi House can right this wrong. Okay. My last remaining hope for defeating Crimson Helm is the Satomi Canine Warriors. They have protected the Shrine and served the Satomi House for ages, but alas, they are now scattered throughout Nippon. If we could bring them together again, they could break the barrier and retake the shrine. Then why don't you just summon the puppies back? I've already tried, but I've yet to receive any word of their coming. I sense their presence nearby, but I've yet to find them. What if they were attacked and injured, or even worse? I beg you, would you please sniff out their whereabouts? You might find this useful. Oh, okay. What's that? Uh, <laughs> sat nav, or...? Canine tracker. Oh, I wasn't too far off. It will sense five of the Satomi Canine Warriors here in this village. They're a temperamental bunch and don't take kindly, but they should return to me once they see the tracker. Go to the destination. Please use it on with your strength to find them. Leave it to us, sweetness. We'll catch them. We'll get them all back without a scratch. Can't wait to see how she thanks us, Amy. <laughs> oh, you dirty sod. Okay. I think we've got to literally follow it. Is there one down there, I wonder? Okay, let me just check my... Um... No, it's not in there. So, uh, I'm guessing we can jump. I hope we can jump down here. Okay. Now I see how this works. So, let's draw a bomb. Right, let's draw a bomb. There he is. What's the dog doing here? Hmm. I think he's trying to say something. I can understand some animals. It's wagging his tail, but I bet it's that canine tracker that got he got there. What is that? Give me some food. I'm hungry. Sheesh. We just met. He's begging for food. What terrible manners. Uh, oh, maybe I can give it some meat. I don't want to use it. Do I? Oh, yeah, I do, yeah. I'm hoping I can find or, or buy some more of that, because I'm guessing we're going to need it for all five of them. His tail's going like mad. Don't eat that fast. God, you'll give yourself indigestion, man. Although Ami is literally just like staring. It's like, you will eat. And you will enjoy eating. And I will watch you enjoy eating. I don't want to skip it in case there's anything important. I am full. My master, Princess Fuse, has summoned me. I didn't want to go straight home. You hear that, Ami? That means this dog's one of those Satomi canine warriors. This is Ray. Now that my stomach is full, I will return to my master. Okay, so that's that one dealt with. The way Princess Fuse talked about them, I thought they were human. You think those flea bags are going to be any help? I certainly hope so.
Just bash all these open, and then we'll get the goodies afterwards. There was something else, there was something else, there we go. Okay, just fell off the edge of the world, that's fine. Okay, I think we've got to go back up. I don't think that's the right way. It's signaling to go up, not not down. Okay. Oh, this is where Sassoon was sleeping. I think we may need to restore this. I hope it's not that skull. Or oh, maybe we need to dig. No, I think I think we need to restore it. Maybe not. Let's try it again. I think the circle's too big. There we go. There he is. Sometimes that's really finicky. Well, not, not so much finicky, but picky. It's very picky about the the circle you use. What's a dog doing here? It's wagging his tail too. He must have been that canine tracker. Canine tracker. Why does these flea bags think we're going to feed them? I think we've got one more meat pack left, so... I'm assuming it's meat they want, because I can't imagine a, a dog enjoying seeds or herbs. So, I think we can skip this. Nice. I am full. Canine warrior Shin. Now, but now my stomach is full, I return to my master. There we go. I think this, the, the, the store is going to be the same. Can you believe those guys? Okay. I'm going to go talk to the merchant at the front. So I wonder if he can give us some more food. Yeah, I'll do some shopping. Nice. We'll need at least three more, so I'll, I'll buy five and then I've got plenty. Oh, okay. It's actually going pretty crazy here, to be honest. Something to do with the, um... Something to do with this merchant. I have to come back for that one. I don't really know how to do that one. Unless it's over here. How strange. I'm going to see if I can pick up the scent of another one. I wonder if there's one up by that Mr. Bamboo or whatever his name is. Hmm. 
Hmm. I wonder where that leads to. Let's let's try this. I know it might seem like we're blatantly ignoring it, but I'm not sure where it's leading us. So let's have a look around here first. Cause there's a tunnel here. And a chest here. Glass beads. Testament to artist's skill. Okay. Maybe that's something we could sell later. Let's have a look in this tunnel. Seems pretty suspicious. And then I'll promise I'll go look for this dog. Oh, there's one. What's the dog doing here? He's wearing his tail, a cannon tracker, blah, blah, blah. This is Ko. Cool, we'll skip, skip these because obviously they're not really giving us anything. Canine okay, Warrior Co. Alright, he's going to go back. So that's three done. I think you said there was five. Was there five? Alright, let's definitely open all these because you never know what they're hiding. Probably just money, but again, money is good. All right, let's get out of here. Actually, that's a point. Let's have a quick look at our praise. Now we need way more than that. That's it. Am I running into a bush? I think we're going the wrong way. Literally looked away for a second. Uh, I want to go check by Mr. Bamboo as well, because I've got a funny feeling there might be one up there. Probably stuck in that bloody tree of his. Uh, which way was Mr. Bamboo? It was over here. Yeah, it's past uh, him, and then I think we went down here. Oh, okay. It's a strange glow. Maybe there's something inside it. Let's soon find out. Oh, there he is. I said he'd be stuck in a tree. What's the dog doing here? Swagging his tail, blah, blah, blah. Chi. Give me some food, I'm hungry. Okay, he's gonna be closer. So this is four, I think. The only place we didn't really look around was the where Fuse was, Princess Fuse. So I might go have a little quick look up there before I start wandering off too far. Awesome. Maybe we should go talk to Prince of Fuse. Ah, okay, that was my uh, that was my thinking. We'll talk to the bamboo guy in a bit. Oh, I'm happy we got our brush powers back. I suppose it means that you can't possibly stumble onto this quest by accident because you can't do anything with your brush while you until you've dealt with Fuse. So I guess that's really clever uh, level design, to be honest. I'll go talk to her in a bit. It's, the tracker seems to be um, taking me this way anyway, so... Damn. You forget how fast Ami actually is when he gets going. Oh, there is one there. Oh, damn. Look at his eye. Hey, Ami. That flea bag's giving you the evil eye. I think it's, no, it's the canine tracker. What's that? My master, Princess Fuse, has summoned me. But first I wish to try out the skills I've honed on my journey. Princess Fuse forbids me to join in fruitless battles, but I want to prove you're the right, that you're right to bear the canine tracker. 
You've got a lot of nerve picking a fight with us. Well, bring it on, you flea bag. I don't know who this flea bag thinks he is, but he's in for a surprise. It makes sense, I suppose. So this is Tay. It's it on his thing. That did a load of damage. Oh, we ended with fireworks. Juicy fruit plucked from a vine for fill. Oh, grapes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. A worthy opponent, I see. Let us fight where we have more room. You hear that, Abby? Sounds like fun. This time we're playing for keeps. Bring it on, flea bag. You're gonna wish you went straight back to Princess Fuse when you're done with you. Hey, wait, if he's been summoned by the princess, then maybe this is another one of the Satomi Canine Warriors. Yes, I saw his, uh, bubble. I'm done toying with you. Now you shall feel the wrath of the Satomi Power Orb. Bring it on, dog breath. We ain't afraid. Oh, Tay, I thought I heard something out here. You two aren't fighting, are you? Huh, fighting? Ah, oh, no, of course not. Just some friendly wrestling. Look, not a scratch on either of us. At least now we have five of the Satomi Power Orbs. But you've been naughty doggies. Why did you not come home immediately when I summoned you? Hey Princess, what's with the Satomi Power Orb? Each canine warrior bears an orb of different virtue. The Power Orbs are the Satomi House's greatest treasure. I need the orb's power to break the Crimson Helm's barrier. But the canine warriors never listen when I summon them back, and three of them have yet to be accounted for. I fear something may have happened to them. But there is no one I could send out to help them. Hey, what's with the luck, lady? We'll find the rest of them too. I said we get them all back without a scratch. I'll be forever grateful. I know the general locations of the three warriors, so I shall mark them on your map. Well, surely we could just use the thing. They should return here once you've shown it to them. That is, if they've not been injured or even worse. Please hurry, we must get the power orbs. Okay, let's go get them. Eh, yeah, it's, it's a fetch quest, really, but... Eh. It's not an awful fetch quest, so... I don't mind. So... And like I said at the start, guys, I am absolutely... Loving this game. Like... I've tried to play it from the start a few times, but... It always ends up a bit like um, Skyrim in a way where I start something and I never seem to be able to get on with it. So I don't, you know what I mean? I don't break that barrier. But now that I've broken my initial barrier of like how the game is, actually, I'm really enjoying it. But yeah, it's, 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 it's just awesome. Right, I'm going to avoid you. The first one's over on the left, so let's go there first. Nope, out of the way. Okay. Up here, perhaps? Nope, wrong way. I think we've got to go through the gate. Yeah, this one. Oh, have we got to be able to get in? Stream his daughter's been kidnapped. So we're doing everything we can to find her with search alive and no one's getting through that game until she's saving sand. Yeah, but I've got to get in there.
Or have I? Uh, zoom out. <sighs> yeah, I need to get in there. Sorry, I was just sort of looking at the map where things are. I want to go and have another look at the cutters as well. No, not that one. Because now maybe we've moved the story on a bit. I, I, there's something about that house that isn't right. Oh, she's not around. Maybe we can do this thing now. Easy smash it to bits. Okay, so can I cut it, I wonder? Oh, bomb. Duh. if I need to drag her to the light, because there's something about moonlight in the last... Yeah, I can drag her. Ah! You saw me, you saw me. Where'd that shadow come from? It ain't human, whatever it is. So you saw me, now I'm going to kill you. I'm going to eat you all up. Bring it on, you spooks. Come out and fight. Are they both possessed? Okay, we've got peacock warriors now. Wow. <laughs> okay, that's boogie. I'm going to be treating them like the flying uh, puffin things. You know what I'm talking about. They're not taking any damage. Why is that, I wonder? Oh, are these guys like the imps with the guitars? I wonder. Yeah. So they come down, you've got to break the guard, and then you've got to do the damage. Okay, that's easy enough. This is the daughter! Ah, it was so awful being locked away by those monsters. It feels wonderful to be free again. Thanks so much, doggy. Here, let me pet you. Pet you? It's like a grope. My name's Chun, precious flower of the Sparrow Inn. Is this the girl the boss of the Sparrow Inn was looking for? I better get home, otherwise Pop will be worried about me. But if I go alone, those monsters might catch me. Would you come back to Sasa Sanctuary? This brat's a handful. Let's hang with her for a bit. Stupid. Why you little? Come on, doggy, let's go. Alright. I knew there was something about that house that just wasn't quite right. Yeah, 
Easy enough. She's gonna drag us through every bloody monster fill bit, isn't she? I don't mind fighting the monsters, but there's no real reason to. I mean, money is not really an issue at the moment, so... Nice. To be honest, I'm just happy we're making progress, because I hate being stuck in games like this, because you end up looking for everything. But so far, it seems fairly straightforward. Right, now let me in, you chumps. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, you scruffy, what are you doing in this house of sanctuary? The whole Sparrow tribe is on high alert. No one gets through this gate until the boss's daughter is found. Huh? Hi, I'm back. Chun, are you okay? Boss, boss, she's back. Chun's back. Oh, yeah, I remember she, he was asleep, wasn't he? Sorry, Pop, I won't go out on my own again. Oh dear. Uh oh. The boss is delighted. You sure about that? That's why Doggy saved me, Pop. You'll give him something to thank him, won't you? Nice. The boss has accepted you. You're lucky. You better come inside. That is one fat bird. Jesus. Bath attendant. This is a century's long, long running Sparrow Inn. Welcome. You're the one who rescued Chun. There's chaos here for a while when she suddenly vanished like that. Thank goodness she's safe now. Okay, I need to know where this dog is. Let me leave just for a second. Because I need to know if there's any other way to go. No, it doesn't look like it. I'm guessing there's going to be like an outback area, and that's where all the st these steps are going to be. So let's go back in. Oh, it's a lift, okay. I wonder what it was. It, I mean, it's not a doorway, it's some form of... We've been waiting for you. You did a great job finding Chun. We want to thank you too. We had to tell Pop about everything you did. He was really surprised. Weren't you, Pop? Jamba doesn't seem like he is surprised by much. Uh-oh. Boss is very impressed with you. We want to give you everything in these baskets as a reward. You can rest at the inn down below, and the hot spring be beside the inn is great for relaxing. Oh, okay. Exorcism slip. Slightly damages nearby enemies. Cool. A vase. That's good for the treasure hunter. And that last any flower. Steel fist sake. Increase attack power, nice. Dragonfly bead. Multiple layers of colour. Steel soul. Test defence. We haven't really had much need for things like this. Like... Wooden bear, that's another treasure. Traveller's charm. Godhood level by one. Okay. That was another one. Coral fragment. And the holy bone. Three units of solar energy. Nice. Awesome. Does anyone else need to speak? I don't think so. Let's move on. So we can rest in the inn. 
and we can go to the uh, the uh, what's the name behind the inn, the spring. So let's have another look around, see what's what. Assessor egg roll, faithful egg dish, fills astral patch. Sassa cake and sassa fruit. I'm sure I ended up in a funny place this time. Maybe the gods are telling me to rest. I have been working hard, but a trader never rests. That's the salesman's curse. Okay, let's see what chopping he's got. Nothing of too much value to me. Board game here doesn't look like it's been used. What is that? It's scary. I love the way they just carry trays and they're just like. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> okay. So we need to get behind the inn find this spring. So I'm guessing that's going to be where we go to... In fact, let's go back down here. Ah! These doors have opened up. <laughs> I'm sure there was nothing... I wasn't there before. It should tie. It's not like it's locked. So how are we supposed to open this thing? Okay, let's talk to. Wait a minute, please. This is such a bathhouse. Sparrow Inn's famous natural hot spring. My friend, the walls run out. We're closed. There's no hot water. There's a hot spring in it. This happened the other day. There's some sort of earthquake. I thought I heard a monster roar, and then the water just stopped flowing all of a sudden. What if it was a disturbance where everything went black? I'm praying for the water to return. It's not showing any signs of springing up. Never before has it happened. So sorry to come this way to be disappointed. I blame myself. I must beat myself with my own fried drumsticks. That's weird. Okay, give us a bit more info, dude. Please start again. I've prayed and prayed and prayed, but this water still won't flow. This is it. It's the end. It's just a bathhouse. What would my ancestors think? We don't take baths, right, Furball? The smell of this bamboo sure brings back memories. The bamboo from Sasa Sanctuary smells like no other. I'm just finishing time for the festival. Hey, it's the old bamboo dude. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hello, little Wolfie. Hello, little Sprice. Thank you for your, your help. Ever since you found the Sparrow Boss's missing daughter, entry to such a sanctuary is possible again. I wish I could thank you somehow. Is there something you're having trouble with? Trouble? Nah. But that Sparrow over there seems to have a problem. Oh, what's wrong? Please leave me alone. I have to put things right. I won't put set a bad example for the others. If I sacrifice my flesh to the gods, they'll revive the spring. Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> you wish to revive this dried up hot spring? Or maybe with some assistance in that case. What was that? What was that? This bamboo tube in my back reacts to underground minerals. It should be able to easily able to detect where the hot spring water is. You sure about that, Gramps? Yes. My bamboo ware never lies. First, I'll need some help. I'll be a good wolfie and dig me a hole. It'll be fun, like a game. I'll pick up the hot spring. I'll explain the hot spring digging game. I'll start walking around. Your job is to rapidly dig so I can get deep in the ground. Many dangers lurk. I'll, be f I'll focus on walking so I won't be able to avoid the danger. If it hurt too badly, I won't be able to play anymore. I'll show you where the hot spring will bubble up. Should I explain it again? Uh, I think I just need to see it, to be honest. I'm guessing I'm just going to follow him around. Triangle square to break the rocks. Once, you're, once you get your companion to the bottom, they'll tell you where to start digging. Rocks come in many styles. Pay careful attention to the different types as you make your descent. The game ends when the time limit is up, or if you and your companion take damage, you'll lose time. Be careful. You can find more time hidden inside giant buds, so don't pass them up. 
Use various techniques to break rocks and progress. Oh crap. I have to bomb it. Yes. Okay, I've run out of ink. I'm hoping this doesn't damage him. This is so random. So I mean, you just don't expect things like this. gone the wrong way. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this side instead this time. Okay, so you can actually put... Um bombs in the rock itself, which is quite interesting. But surely we're going to end up in the same place as before. Once you get to the bottom, right, I've got to get him to the bottom as well. Sorry, I'm dumb. Right, okay. I've got to get him to the where that rock is. Well, that should have been obvious, shouldn't it? Can 
Can I like heal him? Yes. Come on, Grandpa. Right, now I get it. I understand now. It's just me being thick. Jesus. That was cool though, it just took a bit by surprise. Water. The water's flowing again. See? I told you, my bamboo wear never lies. Well done, Ami. Thank you, both of you. I'll never forget this. You both have free access to the bathhouse whenever you want. <laughs> Ami doesn't like that. Oh, I'd dance the hot spring hot forevermore. Yeah, please, please, please stop. Please, please, please. Please, stop. Look, Ami, it's happening again. Oh. Okay, one that. One that. One that. We seem to be getting these, like, brush techniques really easily. Okay, snake in a bowl. <laughs> Nuragami. Oh, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. I have remained hidden here, creeping along the water's surface. I, Nuragami, god of water, am happy to bestow upon you my power. Moisten the thirsty earth and restore the glory of nature. Interesting. That's the god of water. That must mean you've got the water sprout brush technique. Ouch. Oh, for goodness sake, man. <laughs> No, the fried drumsticks are a bad idea. Look for you, Ami needs some practice. Try put the fire with the power of water sprout. Place your brush over water, then draw a line. The water's power will pass into the line, creating a stream. Push on the hot spring, draw a line to the sparrow. Close, but no cigar. There we go. No fried sparrow for you, but at least you can make a stream. But the power of water sprout doesn't stop there. See that bubbling water in the middle of the spring? That's called a power spring. No bubbling water, but you can create an amazing column of water. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about. Now you can control power springs. Ah, it's a way of getting around. We could use this to find treasure in high places. Let's draw a water column whenever we see a power spring. Interesting. Really interesting. But that does not solve our gate problem. No. 
go help with some diamonds going with some babo from the deep thicket deep within the sanctuary. And that means to go through that gate. Ah. The gate won't open until this large bamboo tube sounds. And who knows when that will happen. I'll just have to wait patiently. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's one huge bamboo tube. Could something this big really work? Those things tip back and forth from the weight of the water inside them. Don't know if it's plugged up or what, but it sure ain't moving. I've seen smaller ones in the garden, but that doesn't need much water. But something this size would need some major hydropower. Ah, I wonder if. No, not a power spring. There we go. That's a fairly straightforward puzzle. Obviously, we needed the water power to be able to do it, but... There we go. Let's go in. Because we need to find... All this to find a bloody dog. Granted, it's a special dog, but that's not the point. Someone's up here, and they're not happy. Oh dear. Tweet, tweets. We'll get a lot of tweety here. What's with all the chirping? Don't call me kid. I have a name, you know. It's Ty. And I'm not chirping, I'm crying. Oh, you're crying, so what's with the freaky cry of yours? Take's lost. He disappeared while we were out for a walk. Who's Take? Is he a friend of yours? He's my dog. I lost my dog. Another dog? Count tracker shouldn't suddenly appear. That must mean... We've got to find an eighth dog. Hmm? You see what I see, Ami? Unless I'm hallucinating or something, that bamboo over there looks like it's flashing. Maybe we'll find something interesting if we cut it down. But have we got to be cutting the one? Bingo. What's a dog doing in there? Yeah, how do they? How are these dogs getting inside this bamboo? To the point where they can't get back. Tuck is back. What's wrong, boy? Why are you growling? Wait a minute. Was it this white wolf who spirited you away? Oh, give me a break. I think this flea bag is trying to say something. White wolf. What right do you have to bear the canine tracker? Fight me and prove you are worthy. Canine warrior Guy. You hear that, Ami? This must be one of the canine warriors. The tracker really set him off. What'll it be, Ami? Don't hold back. If he wants to fight, we've got to fight, I suppose. Jesus. It's about time we had a challenging fight, to be honest. What's he done? He put me in a hole. What a sword. Jesus, that hurts. It's actually quite nice to have a challenging fight.
Yeah, he went grey for a second there. I think if we get him in a combo... Yeah, if he misses us, he sort of stops for a second, so... There you go. Took me a minute to work that one out, but it was it was good. It was a good challenge, actually. He actually knocked quite a bit of health off us. Cut it out. Leave him alone. I won't allow you to bully Tarke like that. Keep it up and I'll clobber you. Wait a sec, Tweety. We're not bullying anyone. Right, you flea bag? Come on, say something. I know Princess Fuse summons me. It's my duty to defeat Crimson Helm, defiler of the Gale Shrine, but I cannot return. This place is in grave danger. The monsters will overrun Sussa Sanctuary without me. And the Sparrow Tribe, they would all be... Well, what should I do? Change duty orb. What is this? The power orb has chosen you. I need worry no longer. I shall remain here and battle the monsters for the Sparrow tribe. Even separated, the hearts of the canine warrior beats as one. Wait a second. Okay, whatever. I suppose it'll all make sense eventually. I'll clobber you. Interesting. Right, okay. It's really interesting, guys, but unfortunately I am out of time, so I may have to end the episode here. Uh, we'll look for the rest of the uh, Canine Warriors in the next episode, but uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. It. It's been a sort of a fun episode, but we've also had uh, an opportunity to make some real cool progress, so uh, I'm quite looking forward to seeing where this... Uh, quest goes to be honest so thank you very much for watching i will see you in the next video bye bye for now